Hi, my name is Shasya Sharma and I'm a senior product manager with Amazon S3. I'm here today to share some cost optimization tips when using the S3 lifecycle management features. Amazon S3 offers the most storage classes with which you can store your data. Data can be tiered based on access frequency and enable cost savings when moved to cheaper storage classes. As the number of your S3 objects grow, moving your objects manually between storage classes can be time consuming, especially if you manage millions or even billions of objects within your S3 environment. To simplify this task, you can configure an S3 lifecycle policy that automatically transfers your objects between storage classes at scale. You may want to configure lifecycle policies to move your objects to an infrequent access storage class as they age, or even archive them after a certain retention period. You can also create rules to delete objects and their older versions when they're no longer needed. You can also create lifecycle policies based on data access patterns. To help you determine the access frequency to your object stored in S3, configure S3 storage class analysis for a bucket, prefix, or a specific object tag. The feature monitors access patterns and identifies objects that are good candidates for less frequent storage classes, or even for archive with S3 Glacier and S3 Glacier Deep Archive. Whether you need to configure lifecycle policies to correspond with your data's age, or as access patterns change, Amazon S3 has all the features and analytic tools to optimize your storage costs. For more information about Amazon S3, please visit our website.